Guess who's back? Welcome to. How much you charge for them weeds? If you wanna be Destiny's Child Beyonce, that's gonna cost you two hundred dollars. And if you wanna be Beyonce featuring Jay Z, boom, boom. With all that ass, she ain't safe nowhere. <laughs> In every neighborhood, there's a place folks get together to talk about their dreams, to share their frustrations, and maybe even tell a joke or two. Excuse me, but I don't like to get involved in petty arguments. Yeah, you do. That's primarily what you yeah, do. Yeah, that's pretty much all you do. <laughs> it's a home away from home. And these aren't just friends. Come here, girl. They're family. Check her out. Well, there is a guy. Send me that. The only man that you can trust is the one up above. Each one of y'all want a super thug that's got three degrees from Harvard. Meanwhile, you pass up corny dudes like Gerard every day. Don't no woman want no moist Duncan Hines ass dude like Gerard. Guys, I'm standing right here. I can hear you. Baby, shoot out there. I don't want to tell you Stop playing. Get out. Oh, hell. It take me too long to get back up. I don't even recognize the neighborhood no more. I'm trying to get that call in the middle of the night saying my son is locked up or worse. Them people downtown, they ain't moving for us. We gotta fix our problems ourselves. The barbershop is the pillar of the neighborhood. So we turn the shop into our safe space with free cuts and styling. It's some of my best work. I bet you won't be turned back to his mama no more. Hey, Amen, George Jefferson. <laughs> <laughs> We'll never give up. Your father will be proud of everything that's going on here. Hashtag Barbershop Saves the Neighborhood is trending on Twitter. Can I get a selfie with you? What do white girls want? They lost? Cool. Did you tell them they was awesome? White people love them. You go, awesome. <laughs>